How to make a parametric modular kitchen casework in Revit. Part 14, base unit, washing machine, and dryer. Let's start. Duplicate base unit one door. Copy, paste, and rename the file. Base unit, washing machine, and dryer. Okay, open the file, okay, go to 3D, okay, next, delete the doors, delete the module, delete the void, and delete the shelves and the base go to reference level delete the shelf depth parameter delete this reference plane okay go to front elevation delete this reference plane delete this dimension then go to family types delete the double shelves parameter the single shell delete the base okay delete the module delete the door okay Delete the shelf depth. Delete the door width. Delete the full handle width. Okay. Delete the full handle finish. Okay. Then delete the base unit 1 door with 30 with 90 delete delete with 45 with 30 okay this one rename washing machine okay okay next go to reference level then download and open the file washing machine melee okay open and load into the project make sure it's uh, you check shared pa parameter you check shared parameter so you can schedule the appliances then load into base unit washing machine and dryer okay insert pick select a line select this reference plane select this edge lock select the center reference plane select the center of the washing machine and lock okay go to front next select the washing machine go to graphics visible pick the button create new parameter and type washing machine okay on off okay okay next 
select and let's go to edit type double check okay next download and open tumble dryer melee okay make sure you check shared okay so you, you can schedule the appliances load into the project base unit washing machine okay the insert select a line select this reference plane okay select this edge okay lock select the center reference plane and select the center of the dryer and lock okay let's go to 3d view select the dryer okay tumble dryer melee graphics create new parameter and name it tumble dryer on off okay okay next go to family types okay under washing machine uncheck tumble dryer okay apply then create new type and name it tumble dryer okay next check tumble dryer and uncheck washing machine apply okay save the file okay load it into the project Let's load it into our sample project. <coughs> okay, insert space bar to rotate the unit or the family. Okay, one more for the tumble dryer. Select this one and change it to tumble dryer okay so we have one what washing machine and one tumble dryer select a line select the surface of the wall select the back surface of the box flush okay select the surface and select the surface okay select the side surface okay next let's try add some casework let's add some base unit one door 60 centimeter width okay space bar to rotate then align select the front surface of the box flash select the surface select the side surface okay select this unit edit type let's duplicate let's make a unit with a uh, with a shelf okay uh, uncheck door okay select the unit and let's uncheck the single so we have a uh, double shelves inside the module then let's change the shelf depth to 0.6 meters okay next let's add one more base unit one door okay align select the surface select the surface okay next uh, let's add 
base unit three door three drawers okay space to rotate the unit then align select the surface select the surface select the side surface select the surface okay select the unit mirror or type mm select the side surface okay to finish the the unit let's add an end panel okay align okay select the side select the side surface okay let's add one more to the other side space bar to rotate the unit align select 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 the side surface okay select okay so let's clean the line select the line work select invisible line double click the line so it show up a one countertop okay okay double click to hide the lines okay done thank you